Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. In today's video you will find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators RSI, divergence, stochastic RSI and MACD are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. By looking at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, we can see that the price moved up quickly with around 4.5% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 40,504. We can see that the buyers are taking over because the volume was also high, showing that this move was strong. Moving to the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 56, so there are currently no signs of the crypto being overbought or oversold. Looking for divergence in the hourly time frame, unexpectedly, the price went down despite the bullish divergence. Jumping to the hourly stochastic RSI, currently, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are very high, meaning that the crypto is being high light bought and a change in the trend can be expected or for it to remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually go down. Looking at the hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently indecisive so consolidation for some time or shifting the momentum could be expected and you should wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bearish. Jumping to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 45 so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. On the lookout for divergences in the 3 hourly time frame, the price has already gone up owing to the last bullish divergence. Looking at the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, currently, both the %K and %D lines are very high, meaning that the crypto is being high light bought and a change in the trend can be expected or for it to remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually go down. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. Looking at the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is strong at the moment and we can expect the price to continue growing or maybe at least remaining the same for some time. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price. So please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.